So we've gone through completely building this machine, this $700 gaming machine from the ground up. Then I've walked you through flashing the BIOS, configuring the BIOS, installing Windows, all the drivers to get it ready to this point. In this video, we're gonna test out the $700 build. We're going to be playing PUBG. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Cyberpunk 2077. Helldivers 2. Power World and Fortnite. We're going to be playing these games all at 1080p because we built this system around a 1080p gaming powerhouse, the Power Color Fighter AMD Radeon RX 6500 XT, eight gigabyte card. So let's get started. All right, we're gonna start off with Call of Duty. All right. And when I die, I'll show you my settings. I mean, I'll never die. <laughs> you can see we're in the 90s and 100. Ah, all right. So you can see we're at 1080p, playing at Ultra with AMD FSR 3.0. Graphics look beautiful. The gameplay is amazing. My gameplay isn't the greatest, <laughs> but the game is playing great. All right, well, we won that round. So we see just how great this card did, this budget card did in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Let's jump on to the next game. All right, let's jump into Helldivers 2. Let's get away from these guys. You can see we're already in the hundreds. We've been in the hundreds the entire time we've been playing. Beautiful. And we're rocking it, thankfully. Well, there's a lot more mist and dust around than usual, making things just a little bit more difficult to see. That being said, the gameplay with FSR and everything is usually in the hundreds or in the upper 90s as you see right now. See if I can show you my settings in just a minute. It's kind of hard when you're by yourself in here. This game is intense. Waves and waves of armies coming at you. Whoa. 
Oh no. No, no, no. No. So all those landmines, usually the game is a lot more clear. I guess I'm in a big dune, a big sandstorm. Oh, I don't want to do that. Oh. This game is so much fun if you haven't played it before. Especially when you get in big groups of people. Typically everybody really helps everyone else. You have to to survive. Thought I can get in there. Takes a few to get him. Under <laughs> how what what happened? <laughs> oh boy, how's this gonna work? Well, I seem to be stuck in between a rock and a hard place, literally. Aside from this kind of mess up in the game, you could see that we were in the 90s and low hundreds, so this game was playing great. Hell Divers 2 is still kind of new, I guess, and it still has a few little bugs. They'll get them all ironed out soon enough. But anyway, let's move on to the next one. All right, we are in Pow World. Unfortunately, it is nighttime, so unfortunately I can't see too much. But you can see we're in the 80s, upper 80s, 90s now, lower 90s. She's playing beautiful. Hopefully soon the uh, daylight will come out. No. Anyway, I don't want to kill him, if anything, just to show you a little bit of battle. And we are getting into the daylight, so this is beautiful. 
get to show you a little bit more about the game if you haven't played it and if you have you know this can be a, a little torturous on your machine let me show you my settings real quick maybe he's not following me anymore good all right we are at 1080p at medium we're in the 90s oh v-sync should not be on let's go ahead and turn that off real quick i don't think we were going to have any sort of issues regardless it did jump down to the 40s But yeah, look, it, the game is beautiful, plays amazing. The waterfall there. Let's take, ooh, I don't have her. What about 70, I am a level six, I think. Yeah, too low. I haven't played this game much. Not because I don't like it, just because I'm always reviewing for you guys. Look at that big thing. Maybe I can catch that guy. Yeah, he's not too high. That's all right, we won't catch him. <laughs> but you can see just how great this gameplay is. The performance, not my gameplay. Oh, that's okay, he won't go anywhere. But that is one of mine, Nightwing. This Pokemon inspired game, which is a very nice game. It would be cool if Pokemon were like this. But yeah, in this beautiful world, if you haven't played it, just like Pokemon, you can uh, fight these guys and then uh, when they get weak, throw out a Pokeball and you can potentially catch them. But I am kind of foraging. What's this? Oh, thought it was like a sword or something. But yeah, my little buddy's follow, following me around if he's not stuck in a tree, which he's not anymore. Just a little bit to show you how Pal World plays on the 6500 XT. It plays beautiful at medium. You could probably get away with high if you play with a few more settings, but 1080p medium looks pretty good to me. Let's jump to the next game. All right, let's jump on to Cyberpunk 2077. All right, so 1080p in Cyberpunk. You can see in the hundreds, she's playing beautiful. And no real rhyme or reason to the gameplay, just 
driving around, causing havoc. See just how great that performance is. I'll take care of that one later. Well, we don't have ray tracing enabled, you can see how beautiful that looks. Do we have ray tracing enabled? I don't think we do. Let me show you the settings real quick. So we're at, we do have FSR 2.1 enabled and we're at the quality AMD FX super resolution. So just to make it look nice, we're at 1080p and she's playing awesome. So we're at the medium preset. Then aside from being with FSR 2.1 and again the quality preset but look how beautiful she looks and how beautiful it plays and also I do like that song that we uh entered with in the cop car that was a nice song <laughs> i want your car oh, no. oh come on it's just a car come on maybe this guy will give it to me hi thanks you're so nice i knew it oh i can't get in there someone shoot her before it's too late no, don't shoot me. It's not too late. No, don't do that. I'll take your car. Your boyfriend didn't help you. That's pitiful. <laughs> no. But man, she she's playing amazing. Now, mind you, again, it is 1080p. Had enough of this shit. I don't like your cursing. But I do like your motorcycle. Out for a ride. Oh, 
All right, that's enough of that. Cyberpunk 2077, 1080p. The game plays beautiful. We are using FSR 2.1. They haven't upgraded that yet, but still it looks and plays beautiful. Let's jump on to the next game. All right, now before we get into some gameplay, let's go ahead and show you my settings. We are at 1080p, unlimited here, and under advanced, we are under medium. All right. And we're about to start a game. I'll be right back. So I took care of my first. Wasn't incredibly exciting, but still took care of my first here <laughs> in this round. Took care of number two. He got me, but we still were able to see that we got great performance in PUBG. We did great performance wise again. My gameplay was kind of meh, but at least I did get two kills. Previous game, I got a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Check it out here. But anyway, it's not about my performance. It's about the performance of the card inside of this system. Let's move on to the next game. All right, Fortnite, after grabbing my first few guns, really quickly, actually. I already got my first kill, beautiful. Let me show you what I'm working with real quick in this game. We are playing at 1080p, frame rate unlimited, DX11. We're playing under the medium preset, and we're getting in the, well, we got into the hundreds, we're typically in the 90s, I think. Oh, in the hundreds right now, but I would say comfortably in the 90s. And as you see, she's playing beautifully. Hey, buddy. All right, got myself another one. I need to find myself some health. There we go, here's some more. No, 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 I need to find some health. I cannot battle them now in my current condition. Well, I could, but I'd just die relatively quickly. So hopefully I can find something over here. Get out of his way. Find some more. Oh. Whew. Where? There we go. Thank you. Come 
on. <laughs> Are people just sucking more or is I'm just getting better? I feel like they're sucking more, but I don't know. Ah. All right, so I didn't do too bad in that game. I actually did pretty good, better than I usually do. But anyway, one sec, let me stop this real quick. All right, so the way I've been playing on this machine is I've been under the performance setting right over here, which will enable AFMF, although that's not used in every single game. We'll come back over here. Here we can see all the different games we've been playing. And as you saw, everything played beautiful with those settings. Some games utilized AFMF, some didn't. Some utilized FSR, some didn't. And I showed you all the settings, that way you're not wondering what did what. So that's awesome. Everything played beautifully. Don't think that just because you have a $700 gaming rig, throw on a 6500 XT 8 gig and you'd be perfectly fine. FSR is amazing, it helps out so much when you can't afford a 7900 XTX or an XT, a GRE. The fact that we can do all this with a budget card in a budget system, that is pretty awesome to me. Let me know what you think down below and if there's anything you think I should have changed below. Also, please remember I use the GC513 by our friends at Avermedia to do this recording. Since this card, you won't be streaming or doing any game recording off of it. I do recommend to get yourself a capture card and the capture card is great because you can also use it on your PlayStation, on your Xbox and your Switch as well. So you can use it not only for your desktop, you can use it for your laptop and you can use it for your console. So Avermedia does some pretty awesome things. This is Iggy with This Bites for You Up. See you guys.